everyone had an amazing weekend and um actually right now we're in a parking lot because i'm taking adam to this like bubble place it's like um like take like a pop-up shop i guess because i've never seen it before or maybe they were closed because of covid and they just reopened but um it showed up on my facebook ads and i clicked on it and it's basically a place where they can play with bubbles and like make their own bubbles etc so um they recommended to bring a change of clothes so i brought another um pair of like pants and a another shirt for him and some socks just in case um and then it's 11 a.m right now so i think we're gonna go ahead and play with the bubbles do our thing and then we're gonna go have lunch somewhere around here because this is actually an outdoor mall um so there's a lot of places here and then kind of just walk around and wait for his nap and when we get home i do have a lot of organizing to do our room looks a total mess i did all of our laundry but nothing absolutely nothing is put away our refrigerator it's filled with like a lot of like tiny little pieces of like leftovers from the 4th of July weekend still um because we just cook so much and like different things so um this morning I was seeing like a piece of broccoli in a container a tiny little bit of rice in another one a tiny little bit of like chicken in another one so I kind of want to just clean everything and organize so I know what I have because I do have to place a target order or i might actually have to go to target before going home because we're out of adam's milk and he take he drinks his milk before his nap um and obviously if you guys are wondering mister is over here i don't know if you guys can see him knocked out every single time we get in the car now he just falls asleep immediately like this place is like five minutes down my house and Five minutes away from my house, he falls asleep. Ten minutes away from my house, like, it doesn't matter where we go. Two minutes into the ride, he's sleeping. So, yeah, let's check it out and see what this place is about. I'm excited. He is obsessed with bubbles, so I know he's going to love it. you could see yourself just sitting there on my chair I'm staring at you you don't even notice should have told you straight away you don't have to be afraid guys it's hot as hell um we're gonna go into whole foods now because um we need to eat something to be honest we are both starving so we're gonna go to whole foods and eat some of their like buffet stuff because it's really good and it's variety and adam's peak Little mashed potatoes, veggies, some broth, and some pumpkins. You're eating? Mmm. You want meatball? Okay. Okay, so we just got home. I'm just here checking my Instagram real quick because I really haven't been 
doing that often anymore and I feel like I'm not supporting like my friends like I have to make sure I'm liking their stuff and stuff like that I have some friends that are also influencers so I want to make sure I support their business as well um, I did want to show you guys this ring so this ring look how beautiful that looks Okay, let me step aside so you guys can see that. It is absolutely stunning. I think it cost me like 50 bucks on Amazon. I will link it and put it below, but I saw it because um, I follow the influencer Ra um, Rachel Parcell. I think it's her name, right? Um, I hope I'm pronouncing it right too. But she posts the most beautiful things all the time and she posted this ring and I am like obsessed. So like I'm not wearing it on my wedding ring finger, just FYI on the other hand. But um, it's stunning and it was so affordable. And honestly, I've worn it enough to say that it lasts a long time like i've had it for like three or four months and i wear it and i'm not careful with it or anything like i do dishes i do stuff and i'm over here finishing adam's little leftover capri sun anyways we just got home i put our leftovers because we always have leftovers in the refrigerator i got adam's milk ready but i am gonna give him like 15 more minutes because we just ate so i feel like obviously you know he's still full from his food if i give him milk right now he's not gonna want to drink it and then on top of that he's gonna wake up hungry later because he is used to having his full bottle um before nap or before bedtime so I'll wait like 15 more minutes before I do that. And I wanted to show you guys. If you guys didn't know, you can check my Instagram. I am a member of Young Living, which is a like essential oil, um, very naturally based products company. Um, and you can like sign up to have like monthly deliveries or you can just sign up and buy whenever you feel like you need something. But anyways, I really love essential oils. I'm a true believer. Whenever I feel stressed out and all of that, it really helps me. I always have my diffuser on. I always put it on my Instagram. Um, and besides, like it smells amazing, so why not? Um, but the reason why I started using Young Living after I had Adam is because I started, um, I was using these oils and then I noticed that every time I would buy the same brand from like, I think it was like Marshalls or something, um, every time the same exact oil would be like a different everything. Like it barely smelled the same every single time. So I don't know, I started doing some research and apparently a lot of oils companies out there are not like 100% essential oils or they are not natural, they don't come from a good place, so what's the point, right? Oh, let me fix it. Bring the truck. Um, sorry. Anyways, um, basically, take it. Basically, um, if you're interested, they have now like skincare, body care, kits products for their skin and their body and essential oils for kids and all of that good stuff they have detergent they have dish soap they have veggie wash um soap uh like not soap but you know what i mean um they also have like veggie sprays to clean your fruit so they have everything now so if you're interested in a healthier cleaner life in your house and getting rid of like all that toxic like tide and stuff like that i am in the process i already stocked up and because we buy everything at costco turns out we had like three or four like big gallons of like tide you know like those big ones and then of the all natural too which i think it's called all clear 
So we had three and three, so that's six. And we had a ton of softener, a ton of drying sheets, all of that. But we're actually almost running out of them. So I'm very excited. You want another one? So I'm very excited to do like a video with you guys where I switch over to my like from toxic to non-toxic products um, because I am very excited for that journey too. And then you spilled it everywhere. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, guys, sorry for the interruption again. Um, I'm mentioning this because I bought the CBD oil and this one is the Cool Mint, a thousand milligrams. And I, I just gotta say, I can't live without this thing now. I'm not kidding. I cannot live without it. When I need to calm down, my anxiety and everything, this is what I do. I, and actually the cool mint doesn't taste bad at all. I just make faces because I'm a horrible drinker. Anyway, so if you guys are interested in signing up for Young Living or just maybe more information, go to my Instagram account, Christina on the Run, and you can find more information there. You can DM me, you can comment below. You can send me an email, whatever you'd like, and I'll make sure to sign you right up with the um, oils. But it's like, it's kind of like a lifestyle change too. It's not just oils, unless you only want it for the essential oils. But honestly, once you go through the, you know, whole process of like really digging in and investigating and living like a more, a little bit of a more natural life, then you start getting like addicted to just like per personally choosing better each time, every time you can. Not every single time, uh, but not you're not perfect. Nobody's perfect, I'm not. I'm probably not gonna switch all of my products to it, but the majority, yes. Hi guys, so I'm actually right now filming a reel. And you guys know my camera is extremely heavy, so I'm sorry if I'm shaking. I feel like I always say that, but I am always shaking. So I'm filming a balsamic glazed and some queso fresco on top. Um, a reel for some really delicious roasted Brussels sprouts. So I really love Brussels sprouts um, when they're cooked the right way, I guess. Um, I don't like them just like steamed and like salt and pepper on them. Like that's not my jam. So right now they're in the oven. I'm waiting for them to come out. And in the meantime, I'm gonna clean up around here. Um, and yeah. Okay, so I want to show you guys the reel that I made. We've been eating it, Adam and I, Brussels sprouts, um, with balsamic glaze and whatever, and now we're going to have real dinner. Um, 
at least for him because you know he's a toddler he needs real food so i got this from whole foods today he didn't eat much it's like mashed potatoes, meatballs, and some veggies. And I purposely got extra so we could have for tonight. So I didn't have to cook because I knew I was going to have to do a reel. Um, and since David is not here, I definitely don't want to cook for no reason. Um, but now we're going to have dinner. And clearly, I haven't done any of the things I said I was going to do. So I'll see if I have time today. But you know what? This is how it goes sometimes. We're about to have dinner and right after he has dinner, I wait like an hour for him to like, you know, digest his food and then that's it. I put him to bed and after he's in bed, I don't like to make noise around the house. So we'll see if I get to put our clothes away and all that stuff tonight. Um, but if I don't do it tonight, I'll do it tomorrow morning. So I'll definitely film that. Let's see how the night goes. Hey guys, okay, so it's the next day in the morning. So it's Saturday morning right now. And um, I actually haven't even had coffee. I had a little bit of orange juice that I bought from Whole Foods yesterday. Um, we just had breakfast, Adam and I, and I look a mess. We're still in our pajamas. What? Okay, something happened. I don't know what happened. What happened? You lost something? Anyways, I'm gonna now um, clean out the refrigerator and I'll film that too. Show me. Show me. This is one of the things that was in the refrigerator. I honestly don't know when it expires. Um, oh, it says May. <laughs> End of May. But I'm still gonna make them um, and see how they taste. They are, these cookies are amazing. We buy them all the time because they are gluten free. Um, and David's son can eat them. But I'm just going to go ahead and make them. Hopefully they're not like too dry or anything like that. But they come in like chocolate chip. This is like the sugar one. Um, they have like different flavors. And they're called uh, Sweet Lauren's. They're so good. Um, I honestly love them. Every time we make them, they don't last like through the night they just go um, we eat them almost immediately so they have like better cleaner ingredients than other cookies out there and that's what makes them different I know that I'm making it on like a weird on an actual like cake pan but this is our air fryer and it's like a toaster air fryer situation and it's small 
So none of my other sheets will fit in there, only that one. So I have to do it on that one. And you literally just bake them. Okay, so yeah, you literally just bake them for like 15 minutes after it's ready. And they're done. They're really good. Okay, so all done. I always put like a little Hershey kiss on them because they just look more presentable. <laughs> and then I bought this for another purpose, but I mean, it looks pretty damn good. I might leave it there. I don't know. It's a little too small though. I think I need something a little bigger, but it's beautiful. This is where my heart is, oh you know it's true No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you Okay everyone, so that would be it for today's vlog Thank you so much for watching Please hit the subscribe button and hit the like button If you would like to see more of these videos You can comment below and let me know what you guys liked What you didn't like and what you would like to see more of um, Also I, I'm having some like working on some like organization content for you guys soon. So yeah. Anyways, we're getting um, we're gonna get ready now to go to dinner. David actually just got home from his work trip, and I organized everything in the house. I feel peaceful. I feel good. And today is Saturday. Tomorrow, I don't know what we're gonna do, but anyways, we're gonna head to dinner tonight and. Try to enjoy the rest of the weekend. I hope you guys enjoyed your weekend too. Bye.